Hi everyone and welcome. I'm Arabus and today I'm gonna talk about a brand new uh, event that just started called Mine. As you can see it says uh, dig a mine, open chest and get valuable rewards. Uh, once the event is over your unused tools and event currency will be uh, traded for gold coins. So basically uh, which means open chests uh, some as uh, Silver ones doesn't count, but gold, purple, blue or legendary uh, has a chance of giving you items for digging in, in mines. So let's go to the event. Uh, yeah, uh, by the way, event uh, lasts for three days. So let's go to the event. Uh, I'm not, uh, yeah, as you can see, uh, you have uh, options here, chest of tools. Uh, every day you're gonna get one free one. And uh, if you are going through the mobile or your phone, uh, you can watch five videos to get another chest of, to of tools. So basically you can get two chest of tools per day. Uh, one chest of tools uh, contains, as you can see, 12 pickaxes, uh, five flares and one dynamite. Uh, how does it work? Uh, pickaxe uh, destroys single uh, square if it's white. Uh, for blue ones, you will see eventually you will get you will need two uh, pickaxes. Uh, what's called flare? Flare destroys uh, all the white ones uh, in a horizontal line. Uh, these rocks uh, are not destructible. Uh, yeah, not destructible. Uh, so flare destroys only white ones, and if it encounters the blue ones, uh, the first blue ones that it encounters towards the left or towards the right, uh, let's say it does uh, one uh, damage to it, and you need two. So either two axes, pick axes, to destroy a blue one, or one flare plus one pick axe, or you can use two flares to destroy but first blue ones. Imagine all three of these are blue ones and you activate here flare, you will only uh, do damage to the first square. Second and third won't be touched. Uh, dynamites destroys uh, all uh, destructible uh, squares in a square three by three, but you have less uh, dynamites. Uh, what's the point uh, and the main goal here? Uh, to collect these, uh, let's call it gems, they are eventually found out uh, under the squares that you destroy or in empty spaces. Uh, and in those squares and empty spaces, not all squares, you can find uh, items for destructions, uh, for digging mines or some valuables in the, in the game. Uh, before starting, uh, yeah, let's check out uh, the progress. As usual, you have progress, some free words and some uh, that requires event pass. Free ones are legendary chests uh, and uh, purple room. Uh, to get to the ladder, you just need to dig as, uh, go, uh, as much as you can uh, going down. So levels. Levels are only that are counting uh, towards the... Towards the rankings and as you can see this is level four one two three four i guess okay let, let's no no i'm not gonna do first one not until i'm uh, done talking about everything uh in cell options uh, uh yeah i said they are called gems they are called nuggets sorry guys uh this is first time for me seeing this event also uh nuggets uh i'm i'm familiar with this uh event because in one other game that I used to play had pretty much similar game. It also was digging the mine and everything and almost everything is the same. Almost. But never never mind about it. Yeah. Uh, to get free rewards you need to go get uh, these nuggets. It says 300 to get first reward but I'm sure rewards are gonna be 20, 30. I, I'm not sure. We'll see. Also with nuggets you can buy these chests. Chest of tools containing pickaxe, flare, and dynamite for 300 nuggets. Uh, treasure hunter chest. Uh, some random rewards from here. It's decent, nothing spectacular. 
maybe this is a 1000 elixirs is very very good reward everything else is okay 30 attack points yeah it's decent reward but 500 nuggets let's see large treasure hunter chest unique rewards 10 summoning stones 15 legendary quantums 60 regular quantums and these rewards a little bit increased uh, compared to the treasure hunter chest and huge tra uh, treasure hunter chest uh, unique reward skins for regular heroes yeah so basically for 9000 nuggets you will get one skin free skin let's call it free okay uh, let's check out the rewards for the event pass as you can see it costs either 10 bucks or 20 bucks uh, Rewards in the progress bar, red uh, relic, 150 legendary hero quantums. Uh, I guess that's uh, this uh, this reward. Now oh, let me check. Yeah, uh, 150 uh, legendary. Quantum, so I guess from this hero, so you're not getting immediate legendary hero, you're getting only 150 out of the 210 uh, uh, quantums that you need to get legendary heroes. Uh, pet chest containing 24 pet quantums, one chest of tools, random blue quality room. Where, where are those rewards? Am I blind or something? Ah, yeah, okay. I'm, I was blind. Sorry, guys. Uh, also, if you uh, decide to go with 10 bucks, you get 25 chests. Uh, twice as many nuggets during excavation, which is good. And you get this uh, thing called lantern. You can view where's the some uh, treasure hidden, so you don't need to waste your pickaxe or flare or dynamite by destroying some uh, empty squares. But if you decide to pay 20 bucks, you will get immediately uh, legendary hero, same as this one, and just more uh, chest uh, of tools, and of course uh, more more uh, VIP points. For me, if I would decide to go for it, I would go for the cheaper one. This is double price for skin. Of legendary hero even though i uh, don't have this legendary hero but i wouldn't pay double price to get skin i will eventually get that hero so i will go for this because these two are same rewards double vip points okay it's double and more chest tools so if you have money go for the bigger one if you have a lot of money go for the bigger one if you have enough money go the, for the gold pass and start playing okay how do you play i'm not gonna waste everything here now i'm gonna still wait okay what's the restore button ah yeah what are the sets ah you can buy some uh chest of tools uh for the real money five bucks for ten ten chest ten bucks for 25 you can buy for 10 bucks that event pass and get 25 chests but some people will uh, spend a lot more money to get those those chests or you can buy one chest of tool for 150 diamonds which is expensive if you ask me but it's your money it's your uh, diamonds so play as you like so as you can see uh, to progress i have only one square to destruct and i'm not gonna use dynamite and waste it uh as you can see uh it would destroy only this one and uh six squares would uh that wouldn't do anything and these two squares uh it won't destruct so basically one out of nine for dynamite so i'm gonna use pickaxe and destroy it okay some barrels that are doing high amount of damage and here are some rewards i didn't even manage manage to see what everything i got 
but in video you would be able to pause it and check it. Uh, you cannot go backwards. Uh, you can go only down. Uh, down. Uh, this is your main screen, and which is just going down, down, down as you progress. As you can see, at the moment I'm at level 16. It won't go that fast like this one, with one pickaxe got extra 12 levels. But uh, here I'm gonna uh, just to show you how the flare is working. As you can see, this is, these are the blue ones, and these are the white ones. White ones are single uh, unit to destruct, blue ones you need two pickaxes. As you can see, if I put uh, here where the first one is blue, and we don't know what kind of this uh, square is, uh, could be blue, could be white, uh, if I put here, uh, it would go over the white one, destructing the white one, and uh, do some damage over here. Maybe full destruct, maybe just one part if this is blue one. But if I go over here in this row, uh, as you can see, it doesn't go over to this square because this, here is the blue one. So it would just, let's say, uh, do one out of two damage to the blue one. I would need to use either two flares to destruct this one and touch this one, even though I don't know uh, what kind of square it is. So let me show you. Uh, I'm gonna do over here. Yeah, as you can see, blue ones, it's cracked now. I need one more, uh, either flare to destruct both on the left and the right, or two times pickaxe. I would recommend better using pickaxes for destructing one or just two. Flares are good when you're gonna destruct like five or four, five or six uh, squares. Uh, with single blow. Let me do. I'm hoping to get something to show you. Nothing. Nothing under there. I'm not gonna uh, try. Okay, let's try dynamite just to show you. As you can see, it uh, covers up uh, nine squares. So let's check. All three blue ones immediately destruct, destroyed, but we didn't know in this corner it was blue one. You cannot know until you de uh, destruct first one touching it and then you uh, highlight it. But if we uh, had a lantern, I think we would know what kind of uh, square th this was. I'm not sure. Okay, so let's progress a little bit more. Uh, to go down, uh, you can, like, like I said, you can always uh, destruct everything, but you're gonna spend all your items very fast. But you never know what's hiding uh, behind those squares, maybe nothing, maybe something. As you can see, uh, you saw, I destruct those squares, I didn't get absolutely anything. So let's destruct this white one, because uh, the stone ones you cannot destruct. So, destruct it. Okay, I moved another level. And here I'm gonna use another pickaxe. I cannot go over here, as you can see it's uh, uh, in the red, only green ones. I could use this one, to destruct this, this, and this, these three squares, but I'm not gonna waste dynamite on that. For example, this would be a much better, uh, much better position to use dynamite because I would destruct five squares with single blow. But I'm gonna show you flare when to use it. Either destruct, no, don't destruct this because th there's a blue one. If I destruct this one and use a flare, flare would stop over here. That's why I'm gonna use flare over here. As you can see, it will destruct uh, all uh, row. Yeah, even though you don't see what kind of square is the here, uh, as you can see, it's in dark mode. Uh, you can uh, distinguish uh, which is the white square and which is the blue one. I didn't know from start. So this is blue one, this is blue one. And these gray ones, dark gray, uh, are uh, white ones, so one click destruction. So I'm gonna use flare to destruct the whole row over here. As you can so see, uh, I got 14 uh, f uh, fourteen purple skin, uh, skin uh, points. So what to do here? Either use dynamite and destruct immediately blue one, or go, I don't know, two times with pickaxe. 
Okay, let's go with pickaxe. Uh, let's go over here. And now I'm in pickle. Uh, I could use pickaxe to destroy this one, pickaxe to destroy this one, and uh, then you don't know what kind of row is coming up. Or I can use uh, dynamite, immediately destruct all these fives. So let's do dynamite over here and I think, no, maybe better this, immediately destruct this blue one, yeah. Yeah, some, uh, I got 24 nuggets. So you saw, after destructing several squares, I got only 24 nuggets. Uh, which is shown over here and I still need 276 to do, uh, unlock first reward or oh, 276 to unlock this one but when you reach zero here you won't uh, spend your nuggets to unlocking a legendary chest but if you buy something from here then you're gonna spend your nuggets yeah this is pretty much it there's nothing more uh, to say. I would recommend just going uh, as further more down. Maybe some uh, using flare when you see a lot of uh, squares to destruct with single flare. Not sure what what is the best strategy because you are limited with this uh, amount of uh, tools, but you will have chance every day to get two ch free chest of tools. Also. If you are uh, opening a lot of gold, purple, uh, blue, or legendary chest, you will get some uh, tools also. So not many tools there is, but use them wisely. What can I? What else can I say? Okay, uh, like I said, uh, this video is getting a little bit too long, so I'm not gonna use everything now. I will use it later, slowly thinking what to do some strategy let's say okay that's it about this uh, uh video if you like it please give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit subscribe button to stay tuned up with uh, my new videos also if you have any questions feel free to leave uh, them down below in comment sections uh thanks everyone for watching and see you soon